a 13 year old, the doctors gave me three months to live. He had just lost everything and he had lost his hope. Going in for a checkup for the first cancer, they found a second cancer. The doctors gave me 14 days to live. He said, Mom, if I don't make it, I've had a good life. And I said to Sean, I said, you're gonna make it. Didn't want to lose my little baby. The cancer could, could take my body, but it could never touch my mind. I'm cured of cancer, but I'm not done fighting it. And I'm gonna continue fighting it just to give people hope and let them see what's possible. Well, I've completed um, the highest mountain on every continent, which is the Seven Summits, and I've trekked to the bottom of the Earth, the South Pole. I only have the North Pole left. There are two polar bears sniffing around. Uh, one of the team has seen the prints, and two of the bears approached one of the camps. Sun doesn't really do a good job of, of warming anything up. The only time this usually works is when it's about minus 40. There's five of us on this expedition. There was originally six. And, um, and, and unfortunately, one person had to be evacuated. But it's a relentless place, the frozen ocean. Absolutely relentless. It takes no prisoners. No cancer survivor has ever done the, the Adventure Grand Slam before. It's something that needs to be done, proving that you can go to literally the ends of the earth to give people hope. <laughs>